Good afternoon and welcome to Upper Tutin Park and today we have a rather lovely three bedroom semi detached house. Now to be honest this house probably hasn't been touched for 40 or 50 years so we are going to call it a bit of a project but it's about a seven minute walk from Ballam Tube and Mainline Station and there's some really good independent and state schools within a few minutes walk as well. So let's have a look inside and see what you think. Now we have priced this house to allow for those works and also for a quick sale. There's no chain. Let's have a look inside. We really do like the history of this house. The original land conveyance in 1933 was transferred by no less than the member of the Duquesne Court family, with Duquesne Court now just around the corner. Our client eventually purchased the property in 1971. Now, estate agents always talk about potential of properties, but I'm sure you will agree as we wander around the house, this property really does have massive potential. As we said earlier, it's probably not been updated in the last 50 or 60 years. There really is a blank canvas for you to create your own designs. There's even a gardener's WC. Now what will you do with this space? We're actually going to head out to the garden through the rear reception room. Just loving these character tiled fireplaces. Not sure if they're going to be kept, to be honest. So let's head out into the garden. Now we could say via the sunroom, but I think that's taking it a step too far. The garden is a little overgrown at the rear and you'll see from the drone shot in the top left hand corner now, it really does go back a fair distance. The floor plan actually says 51 feet, but believe me, we're not going to work our way or fight our way through those brambles. There is a shared access and you'll see the uh, side access gate just on the right hand side. Clearly you've got huge amount of potential to extend into the loft subject to the usual permissions. So let's head upstairs and have a look at the first floor. Pretty certain we do have some original windows here. So you've got some beautiful stained glass leaded light windows. Bedroom one, good size double bedroom with this beautiful angular bay. Bedroom two is also a good size double and overlooks the rear garden. Lots of uh, building wardrobe cupboards here, but I think sadly they will go as part of the refurbishment project. Now, do you use bedroom three as a single bedroom, home office, or a little walk-in dressing room? The choice is up to you. What you will see in a lot of the bedrooms are these vanity lights. It's where the lights are off center nearer the window. So apparently in 1930s, before the advent of curtains, you could get changed at the back of the room and the reflection of this light would stop anyone seeing in. We're not going to put it to the test. The bathroom has clearly been replaced since original, fully tiled and very easy to keep clean. And at the moment, you do actually have a separate WC. But again, as part of the refurbishment, this would probably be knocked through to a combined WC bathroom. Thank you for watching our video tour of Upper Tooting Park. I'm sure you will agree it really is a very special house with so much potential. If you have any questions or indeed would like to arrange a viewing, please do contact Porter's Estate Agents on 020-8772-1004. Thank you.